All right, thank you very much. You gonna be okay? All right, there we are. Uh, hi everybody, I'm David Wells, the CEO of Enclave Markets. I'm here with Mr. Phil Wurches, who is our head of strategy. How are you doing today, Phil? Doing great. The energy awesome. at this event is amazing. Paella may be even better, and we're here to talk about the facts, so super excited. Absolutely. Uh, so for those of you who don't know us yet, Enclave Markets is the world's first fully encrypted exchange. We're gonna explain what that means uh, in a minute here, but uh, we are incubated by Ava Labs. In fact, a year ago, Phil and I were here uh, giving a presentation about what Enclave could be uh, over in the monastery. And I think there was about, what, 10 or 15 people max, maybe? Yeah, if you count our parents, I think it was 10. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> uh, that's right. So we're really glad to be here on this stage uh, presenting what we've actually been able to build over the last year. And oh man, has a lot happened in the last year. So in the last year in crypto marketplaces, we have seen craziness. We've seen catastrophic collapses, malfeasance, basically uh, any kind of misbehavior or uh, market failure, we've basically seen it in the last year. Uh, the main reason for that is because in a decentralized industry, we've ended up with centralized capital markets for the most part, market structure. We need to step back and ask, why is this happening? How did we get here? And how do we change that dynamic from continuing to happen again? Ultimately, the main answer, the root cause, is that marketplaces are inherently vulnerable. This is true in traditional markets. It's particularly true in a burgeoning uh, asset class such as crypto. So this is gonna continue to be the case until we have infrastructure, market infrastructure, that provides our core value props of decentralization, providing for a fair, secure, and performant marketplaces. So let's take a quick step back, go through history of the evolution of exchanges in crypto over the last decade plus, and uh, see where we arrived today. So Phil, when you're thinking about, you're a trader, right? You do a little trading? By the loosest definition of the term, yes. Great. When you're deciding which platform to use to make a trade, what are the main factors that you're considering? Look, there's two things. Are my funds safe, and am I getting best execution? Right? That's right, yeah. I think everybody would agree in here that safety of funds and getting the best value for your trade, another word for that is market integrity or fair or unfair trading practices, are very big considerations. So let's evaluate the evolution of exchange, exchanges uh, with these two axes in mind. So first, I think we all know the centralized exchange model. Go back to Mt. Gox in 2010. We should reflect and say, you know, we might not be here without a, this type of model uh, coming to be back then. Because for the first time, you had a 24-7 global marketplace for supply and demand to meet and to be able to move between fiat and crypto and then crypto to crypto. So that provided a lot of value. We brought in institutional capital with uh, mature market makers, liquidity providers. Um, it's... Uh, it's supposed to not have any settlement risk because it's pre-funded and so your, your trades are, are settled immediately and then you withdraw your funds. But unfortunately what happened was we sort of mirrored in a lot of ways how traditional markets operate and that is by having a central entity uh, control the marketplace, controlling the order book, controlling the user's funds, vertically integrated model and that ultimately leads to malfeasance, fraud and bad practices. So then let's fast forward to DeFi Summer which Phil is very much a part of. So DeFi, really in the advent of uh, 2017, 2018 with the launch of DEXs, um, a lot of the problems from centralized exchanges were solved. And you're right, DeFi Summer was uh, an acceleration along that curve. But basically what DEXs introduced was a way to hold onto your funds as the user. No longer did you have to trust centralized exchanges, trust some person behind the curtain with your money. Um, and they allowed anybody to launch liquidity pools. So you started making markets in a place where there otherwise was no markets. It's amazing for uh, the ability to trade, but they also introduced their own problems. So one thing that, that um, DEX has introduced was little to no compliance, um, and it's perfect for retail traders, but for the market to get more sophisticated, you need a little bit of compliance to come into the space and usher in that, that capital off the sidelines. And that's exactly what we've tried to do here at Enclave Markets, is take some of the great learnings from centralized exchanges some of the beautiful things from DEXs, slam those two things together so new users can trade for the first time on a fully encrypted exchange, which is a hybrid between the two, and is meant to take crypto markets from where they have been in the past into the future. 
Awesome, so before we get into the technology, we wanted to talk first about the value prop of a fully encrypted exchange. What does it actually mean? What does it provide for you? So we talked about bringing together characteristics, the best characteristics of decentralized and centralized finance. There's three main uh, core value props of the FEX model. So first is the confidential marketplace. In this, uh, in this protection, because it's fully encrypted, no one, not even the exchange operators, can see your trades or have an advantage of the order book uh, before anybody else. So it's truly a fair, neutral marketplace, and that's, protect that's written into the code. The second is that it's tamper-proof. So there's no backdoors to the code, no changes that can be made um, that are obscure. Uh, all of the changes, all of the updates are approved by an external network of independent third-party attesters, which we'll discuss in a minute. Uh, but this essentially guarantees uh, the validity of the code base and, and cryptographically shows that nobody has been in there messing around, essentially. The third is decentralized custody. So this is a really important point. We, as the exchange operators, cannot unilaterally go in and take your funds, lend them out, send them elsewhere. You are in control of your funds, and uh, they are protected by this network of attesters all living inside the secure enclave. Okay, so how do we actually implement this? How do we, how do we provide these uh, value propositions which are unique to both DeFi and CeFi? Well, it's a combination of a revolutionary technical architecture using uh, leading edge hardware technology in addition to governance principles of decentralization. So let's get into that. So there's, there's two main uh, components to the FEX model. The first is the secure enclave. This is a hardware technology that actually exists in everyone's iPhone. Um, this is where the most sensitive data lives. It is a physically separate security environment uh, from, the rest of, uh, the, from the rest of your environment. So uh, the best way to think about the secure enclave is, let's say you have a house. This house represents like your cloud environment. So this is, tip you have some protections, you lock the front door. This is typically the model of a, you know, a centralized exchange or any kind of centralized database. Think of the secure enclave as a safe or a vault that is in that house. Nobody can see inside of it, and the only way to access it is through the second piece, which is this network of attesters. So these are independent um, third-party infrastructure providers, and their job is to review and audit uh, the code, any changes or updates, and nothing has changed in that secure enclave without the approval of this network of attesters. So those two things combined create this FEX, which allows the performance of a centralized exchange model, but gives you the protections and guarantees and privacy of a decentralized model. So Phil, what have we built with this technology? We've built three fully encrypted markets. I'm gonna talk you through each of them. I think uh, two of them have been live since last fall. Um, and then today's spoiler alert, there might be an announcement for one brand new crypto market that we're introducing here. Maybe. The first of the three is called Enclave Cross. You talk about Enclave Cross, it's intended to be a fully electronic, um, autonomous, confidential OTC marketplace. And, um, sorry, no, you're, <laughs> um, it's what Enclave Cross is intended to do. Just like OTC desks of the future, it's built to trade size. And Enclave Cross is different because there's no organic price discovery. It all happens externally. So we have a pricing oracle where your trade is guaranteed to execute at that represents the midpoint of the bid and the ask. Uh, and it's all within the Enclave. So no data leakage happens as you're making your trade on the OTC desk um, within Enclave Cross. So there's no more front running. There's no more MEV. There's no more data leakage from a trading desk going outside before your trade gets executed. You're guaranteed best execution here on Enclave Cross. What we've also done is take that idea, taken that model, and worked with some of the best uh, actors in the industry for an enterprise solution. So our first partner is Hidden Road. Basically what we can do here is work with them so that your capital stays with your prime broker. You don't have to move it, so you're, you're operating with maximum capital efficiency on Enclave Cross. You can still execute in the same confidential manner, never moving funds out of your custodian. This is a great unlock because again, capital efficiency, pre-funding trades is so, so important. And being able to move your, your money around in an efficient way as a trader is what's going to unlock that next wave of capital coming in here. And then the third market, again, spoiler alert, Dave, I'll hand it back to you, is an announcement that we're super, super excited to announce today. Yep, not to bury the lead, but the main reason we're here today is that officially as of today, uh, we have launched our third product, Enclave Spot, which is now live. So this is the first, thank you, we're super excited. Yeah. 
please try it out. It's got a really good looking order book. Uh, this is the first fully encrypted spot market uh, that has, has ever been launched. You get all of the benefits of a typical spot market all within the fully encrypted exchange model. Uh, now, in combination with your cross orders, it's all on the same platform. You can do market limit orders. We'll have a, more advanced order types coming soon. And there are some really interesting structured order types that you can do, leveraging uh, the confidential marketplace of the crossing network, where there's no information leakage, no market impact, no slippage. Uh, and then the spot order book, where there's guaranteed execution. So what you could do as an example, let's say you have a large position to move into or get out of. You could take a piece of that, put it into the crossing network, you may get filled in some size immediately, all at that Oracle price at the top of the book with no slippage. And then you may have a resting piece of that order. Maybe you didn't uh, fully finish it. So depending on your time horizon, you can then go onto the spot order book and start working out of it, almost like a TWAP or a VWAP model. At the end of your horizon, let's say you need to just uh, finish the order, you can then uh, have the guaranteed execution on the spot market and be fully finished. And we fully believe, uh, take us up on this, but we fully believe this is gonna significantly reduce overall execution costs uh, as compared to typical order routing or typical OT de OTC desk um, trades today. So we're super excited about it. We'd love to have you uh, try it out. Um, and as a little incentive, uh, Phil has some news. Since some yeah, look, guys, we know that in this market, it's hard to try a new venue. So we wanted to put together a little incentive program. It's going to be the first of a number of programs uh, just to get people on board. So all you have to do is go sign up for Enclave Spot, deposit a little funds, you'll go through KYC, and boom, you're ready to trade. If you trade $100 in the first 30 days from this announcement, we'll put a little airdrop of a Vox in your account so that you have some extra spending money to go test out the product, let us know what you think, and see the power of the fully encrypted exchange. Awesome. We're also focused on what we're gonna do with those existing three products moving forward. So we're keeping our nose down through the end of the year, uh, focus on building stuff on top of Cross, Cross as a service and Spot. Um, notably on Cross, we're focusing on internal outer routing, Basically, the goal here is to improve the probability of being matched. Um, we're also focused on OTC pricing bands. And what do I mean by that? What Basically, mean by that? what we're going to do is add certain parameters on your trade. So if you find a willing counterparty who wants to trade at some price below market, some price above market, whatever the, whatever the case may be, you'll be able to select those parameters on your trade and find a willing, a willing counterparty to do the exact same thing. And the third uh, piece is what we're calling skip the queue pricing. Um, so in this case, if you want to be at the top of the line and get your trade done immediately, you can pay a little extra fee to get up in front of everybody else who's listed on Enclave Cross and execute your trade right away. As a service, we're big believers in the bring your own custodian model. Again, capital efficiency. So we plan to expand this enterprise solution so that we can go to any custodian where you keep your funds. And as long as that custodian can guarantee that your funds stayed locked up, we'll extend credit on top of Enclave Cross you can trade with maximum capital efficiency no matter who you custody with, and then the funds will settle either within that same custodian or intra-custodian as we build out the network. And then finally on spot, um, like Dave mentioned, we're building out order types. We'll, we'll be doing that you know, every week through the, the rest of the year, and we're also gonna add margin. And then as we get later into the year, that's when the really fun stuff starts, right Dave? Absolutely. So sneak, pre just, sneak preview just for this uh, audience. We're going to talk a little bit about what we're building next. So the three products we've talked about are all three live today. Please come try them, uh, check them out. But Enclave Markets, we're called Markets Plural for a reason. The, the FEX platform is a foundation upon which we can build a, tump, a bunch of different type of marketplaces, sophisticated, uh, institutional, and differentiated, in, particularly in crypto. So moving forward, we're really excited to start work on a perpetual futures exchange. This will allow you to hedge your positions in the other markets, go long or short, and be more capital efficient through using leverage. And then we're also gonna be significantly expanding the number of assets and the type of assets we support. So if you're a foundation or a project, please come and talk to us. We'd love to partner with you um, and see how we can work together. Uh, and finally, you never know, maybe one day, even an enclave asset. What do you think, Phil? Hell yes. All right, he's excited. Awesome, so we wanna very quickly say a huge thank you to our partners. It's super important to us and our ethos in this model is that we wanna be the best marketplace providers, the most fair, neutral, sophisticated, but we don't wanna be vertically integrated in doing everything. We don't need, we, we're not an internal market maker. We don't need to be doing those services. So we partner with the best in the industry. We would love to add you to this list and expand this significantly, um, but we wanted to say a huge shout out and thank you to, to those of you who have uh, partnered with us at this early stage. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.
All right, and finally, please don't take our word for it. This system is built to be uh, trustless, so you don't have to trust us. You don't have to look at our tweets and wonder if uh, we're doing okay. Come to trade.enclave.market. Super easy URL to remember. Make your first trade. Get the sign-up bonus. Tell us about your experience of your first fully encrypted uh, exchange trade, and we would love to get your feedback, both here and also on our Discord and Twitter channel. Thanks very much. Cool, guys. Check us out. <laughs>